We met six years ago and we connected quickly because we were both addicts. He was addicted to drugs. And so he understood my addiction to food and didn't judge me. When Alicia and I first met, what I did notice was just her carefree spirit, her laugh, and her size didn't bother me. And I really liked being with her because she was always laughing and smiling. But now it's almost like she's a totally different person. And our relationship has grown stagnant. And as time goes on, Alicia doesn't want to do hardly anything at all. She just wants to sit in front of the TV and eat, which really frustrates me because we have a life to live together. Tim was addicted to drugs, but he got clean. And now I'm the one killing myself because I can't stop myself from eating. If there's any food in the house, I eat it. So we run out of food quickly. So when Tim's at work and we're out, the only way I can eat is to go get it myself. I can't wait all day for him to get home. Going to get food is almost the only thing that gets me out of the house. The only thing I'm really living for at this point is the next meal. But it's not easy for me. I am the heaviest I've ever been. So getting into the car is painful and challenging, and I barely fit. I hate going to the grocery store. And I have anxiety about being in public because I have a fear of people judging me. And if it wasn't to get food for the rest of the day, then I would literally never go out. I can feel people looking at me. I can feel their stares. I feel like an animal that people are looking at to see what I will put in my cart next. But I ignore it all because when I see all this food, especially all the carbs and sweets, it makes me feel happy.